Sample Crate allows you to manage your sample collection in a super easy and fast manner. Similar to Files app, you can cut, copy, paste, move or tag files. Tagging is useful for creating kits. You can tap and tag individual files or you can drag files to an already created tag. Sample Crate is useful because it allows you to run it side by side with other apps like Koala. You can drag individual or multiple files from Sample Crate to Koala to create a kit. Also, Sample Crate allows you to batch rename files. This is a very powerful feature because it allows you to create numbered files, find and replace text, or add text to the name of the files. One important aspect of Sample Crate is the mini player. By tapping the files in the explorer, you can instantly preview them using the mini player at the bottom of the screen. The mini player allows you to listen to the samples or add them to the crate. Now let's talk about the crate. Using the crate, you can add samples to a kit so you can play them via the MPC style pads. You can easily drag and sort the files in the crate or delete individual files. You can export files from the crate. You can tap export and share where you can tag the multiple files in the crate or export them to other apps or you can create a sample chain. This is useful for hardware samplers like the Octatrack or the MPC where you can chop the regions to create other kits. Using the export button you can drag all the files in the crate to Koala or Beatmaker. The order of the pads is also respected. Another important feature of Sample Crate is that you can import video and extract the audio track to a separate file. This is useful for sampling from apps like YouTube. 